The movie King Richard, I sure hope you've seen it, tells a powerful story about the early lives of two icons of American sports. That, of course, are tennis superstars Venus and Serena Williams and their parents. Now, Richard is their father, played in the film by Will Smith. Ingenue Ellis is knockout. She plays her mom, Oracine Price. In this scene, she makes sure that he knows that if he's a king, she's the queen. You never believed in none of this. When did I not believe? I want you to tell me, when did I not believe? You're not the only dreamer in this family. Wouldn't be no dream if it wasn't for me. I carried them inside me and on my back. And I carried you, too, working two shifts so I could put food on your table. That open stance, you got that from me. Oh, you did that? Oh, OK. And I fixed Serena's serve because you messed that up. You did what? Yes, I fixed that toss because you messed it up. Mm -hmm. I'm here, I've been here, dreaming and believing just like you. Mm -hmm. You just don't want to see me. Oh, it's mm. such a great scene. Mm. Ingenue Ellis, hello. You're getting some well-deserved Oscar buzz for that performance. Joining us now, good morning to you, Ingenue Ellis. It's so good to see you. It's so good to see you too. Good morning, good yeah. morning, good morning. Yeah, we're all excited to talk to you. This is the thing when I watched the movie. I had no idea the role that Oracine Price played in the careers of her daughters. Number one, I didn't even know that she played tennis. You see her at the matches and she's sitting in the stands. What did you think about that? I felt that I, I felt a little bit of a little bit of a fool, really. You know, when I was doing my initial research, I looked her up and I saw that she described herself as a coach. And I I really had kind of a, a condescending reaction to that, that that was her estimation of herself was a coach. She was a mother cheering on her daughters. That does not a coach make. But then when I got the job and um, found out the, 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 the truth of Miss Oracine's journey with her daughters and with her husband, she was absolutely her coach, their coach. And she trained herself to teach her daughters how to play while she was working two jobs and being yes. their mother. <laughs> and An Anjanu, uh, this movie is getting a lot of Oscar buzz. Um, what would it feel like to, to be nominated? You know, here's the thing. <laughs> that is something <laughs> that is completely out of my hands. Right. And I, I just, I, I can't, it's out of my control. So let me just say, for me, honestly, and this might sound a little corny, but I don't care. I'm just so excited that I'm a part of something that gives us, this country, a chance to give Miss Oracine Price her flowers. Mm, yes, yes. Because yeah. I was like you guys, you know, just see, well seeing said. her. You know what I mean? And just seeing her in the stands and with those fashionable glasses on and looking yes. cute, you know? But yes. she, look at her, you know? She's just, yeah. she, her imprint on the sport of tennis and sports right. as we know it in this country is is priceless. So yeah. that's that's exciting to me. That is exciting, Anjanu. You know, and, and she was necessary, as one little girl wrote to you in a letter. Uh, and this movie corrects the record on that. And it does so in part because of that amazing scene in the kitchen. You go head to head with Mr. Richard, King Richard, uh, Will Smith. Uh, how yeah. much of that was scripted and how much is that was that you just being in character in the moment? That was all scripted. That was all scripted. Um, we worked on that scene and we worked on that scene and we worked on that scene up until just that morning. Um, because we wanted to get those words right. Um, mm. Because yeah. I, I, I felt, accomplished. Yeah, thank and and for me, you know, there are going to be so many more movies that are going to be done about Venus and Serena when we're all dead and gone, right? Because yep. great writers look to those kinds of figures to tell those epic figures to tell epic stories. But how many times are we going to get a chance to tell Miss Orsine's Price story while she's alive? I want to tell your story so, in 30 seconds or less, Anjanou, because you said before you take any role, you ask yourself three questions. What are they? One, two, three, please. Do I want to wake up in the morning and go to work to do it? <laughs> am I going to make my family? Am I going to embarrass my family if I do it? I may, but hey, you know. Um, <laughs> are they going to be happy at the end results? 
and oh uh, god i don't know Do, will i get a fun? chance to sit in no 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 will i get a chance to talk to gail king at the end of this? Oh, <laughs> yes. there you go. Sure. yeah and will it be a service of black women let me just tell you something yes, mission absolutely. accomplished for you we are cheering you on. Oscar well nominations coming up very soon. I sure hope they call out your name. Thank you, yes. Ange. Come Ellis. to New York next time. Thank you. Thank Always you, welcome. Oh, That'll God, do it for I'd us. Cheering you on. We'll see you tomorrow on CBS Mornings.